Hello everyone, it's The Voice here. <laughs> I promise I'll take some video of myself, you can actually see me. Um, so I'm headed up Cottonwood Canyon Road. It's one of my favorite places. Um, it's 54 miles to the next town um, on this dirt road. I've checked the weather forecast um, and there isn't any rain until Wednesday and then on Thursday it's supposed to clear up again um, which is good because this road has a lot of bentonite clay um, so if it does rain you just have to stay put until it dries up again hopefully in a day or so. This can be driven in a day Plenty of people do, they fly through, um, do a quick hike or something, but I'm going to spend several days because I just love it out here. So just ahead of me there is, um, these are called the Straight Cliffs, and uh, the blue layer you can see about halfway down is called Tropic Shale, and it's actually part of um, left behind from what used to be an inland sea here, the Cretaceous Interior Seaway. It actually connected to the Arctic Ocean, um, to the Gulf of Mexico. So um, all kinds of creatures have been found in this shale, um, like the short-neck plesiosaur, plesiosaur um, and other fossils. It's a pretty fascinating area. I'm at about uh, 3.4 miles of Cottonwood Wash from the southern end and you come to this area where there's a wash you got to make sure you don't park where uh, somebody will hit you coming over the brow of the hill but there's this incredible Cretaceous oyster bed here and it goes on for quite a ways down this wash. I came down this wash a little further and I found this layer of coal. Gotta watch where I'm stepping here because uh, there's still some moisture in this wash and there's bentonite clay in here. I wanna clog up my shoes too much. So here I'm actually walking on shells.
another name for this area is the Coxcomb and it's because of these uh, sandstone ridges here or these sandstone rocks they also call them the Sentinels it runs along a huge section of this road Uh, here you can look back at the um, the coxcomb. You can see why it called it the coxcomb. And we were on. I was driving. The road is on the right-hand side of them. So you were looking at the Entrada sandstone side. But this is. Oh, well, this whole area is like this. It's really fascinating geologically. I remember this spot. I camped here one night a few years back um, and I wrote a poem about it. I'll post the link on here when I get it and if you are interested. And that rock on the right there, I believe, is called Santa Claus Rock.
kind of at the north end of uh, Cottonwood now. Coming out. Van here is 16 years old as well, so <laughs> he feels it. 